What's going on YouTube? It's Jimmy here from Wolfpack Reacts and today's video is brought to you by I'm kidding. I don't have a sponsor. That would be really cool, but not yet. We're still really really early on. So yeah. Anyways, <laughs> Back again with another reaction video for you guys today. This time we got, man, I've been waiting for this all day. Tom McDonald's latest song slash video. He said this one's not even on his new album, Ghost Stories, right now. And as you guys can tell from the title, this is Cloned Rappers. I got the notification earlier today while I was at work. Man, I wanted to click on it so bad, but I was like, nope, I gotta wait. I gotta wait. I got to drop a reaction to this shit, so here I am. <laughs> so, man, I'm super stoked for this. Real quick, if you guys haven't already, hit that subscribe button, click the little notification bell, become part of the Wolfpack, get notified every single time to bring another badass reaction to y'all, just like the one we're about to do right now. Man, I'm super stoked for this. If you guys haven't, if you guys don't know Tom McDonald, go check out his other stuff, man. Definitely. Like, Pause this, click off it for a minute, go check out some of his other works and everything. That way you get a feel for who he is, and then come back to this one. Or, hey, let this be your first experience with him. Watch this, and then go back and watch all his other shit. I don't care. You got to check out all his music. He's a dope-ass rapper. Real, real conscious rapper. I know that, that term's kind of thrown around and stuff like that. Man, but he really, he's got his head on straight. He knows what he wants. He goes and gets it. And he plans things out like years in advance. So it's crazy the things that this guy does. Uh, but I'm super, as you guys couldn't tell already, I'm super excited to see get to this video and this song here that I'm already tripping over my words. As usual, I've already got the lyrics up on my phone so that we don't miss a single bar. So without much further ado, without too much more rambling on about whatever and nothing and sometimes, let's get right up in it. Tom McDonald cloned rappers. Yeah. The Illuminati knows the answers, taking bone samples to clone rappers. But the artists in prison to silence their vision, genetic copies going home after. He looks so weird like that. I mean, I saw the album, the album artwork yesterday when he dropped it on Facebook and everything. I saw the album artwork when he dropped it on YouTube. Um, but he still looks weird as fuck, especially that close-up. He looks weird as fuck with no hair, and you don't see his tattoos. But he's still got the piercings and the grill. Like, what? It, it's just so weird to me. It really is. The Illuminati knows the answers, taking bone samples to clone rappers. But the artists in prison to silence their vision, genetic copies going home after. They look different, eyes shifted, smile missing, skin lifted, it's scientific. If they can't control you, they erase the old, you get your duplication to enforce the message. They clone Gucci, clone Kodak, clone Eminem, he ain't raps his encore, know that. Cloning rappers when they overdose to keep making money from producing more tracks. The game is a sham, turning the artists who challenge to sacrificial lambs. The labels and devils are shaking hands, creating our artists and labs. Damn. Like. And whoa, whoa. Where's it after near fatal car crash? One of those fake news story things that kind of pop up. But dude, like what he was just saying there. <clears throat> like, he's talking about the Illuminati, of course. It's a big conspiracy theory out there. The Illuminati controls the world and stuff. It's a secret organization kind of thing. But like, basically saying that the industry is just all about pushing out the same things over and over to the same people whatever's popular they clone everybody make them who they wanted to be and then push them out there to control the masses so you think what they want you to think <clears throat> and everything like damn and I guess there's right there the cloned Eminem he ain't rapped since Encore like if you guys didn't notice like Eminem changed up his style quite a bit for a little while there for a little while. He kind of went back to the old M in like Kamikaze. It said when he dropped that. And like a little bit in the album right before that. I forget the name. I think Encore was the one right before that. I don't know. Um, I'm getting my timeline mixed up on the albums. So don't trash me too hard for not knowing the discography of Eminem. He puts out so much freaking shit. Um, so yeah. But I mean knowing that clone rappers when they overdose. To keep making money for producing even more tracks. Like... Seriously, anybody dies or something like that? Okay, we'll just bring them back. We're going to bring them back however we want them to be. Like, dude. Like, he's got some deep messages in his lyrics without even really... You got to really listen and hear the message. Sorry for the rambling on there for a minute. 
but yeah. Devils are shaking hands, creating our artists and laughs. The executions have been televised, though. They're on TMZ like a night. They take our heroes, give us weaponized clones. The revolution won't be televised. I can't be replicated. Copy the attitude and the chains, but no one will ever do me the same. I can't be replicated. Try to control me, then guess again. Rebellion lives in my DNA. I can't be replicated. Duplicated. Damn, that chorus is just that main part right there. That, that system designed me to be a slave gets into a matrix that can't escape. I can't be replicated. Honestly, I thought he said glitch in their matrix. But I'm looking at the lyrics. I was too in tune watching the video here. But like, I thought he said glitch in their matrix. That's why I was like, holy shit. And I looked down and it gets into a matrix they can't escape. But I mean, that's still the same thing. You know, the system designed me to be a slave in a matrix they can't escape. Like, the system designed them to be a certain way and to not be able to get out of it. They have to stay within that, those confined lines pretty much. But I do like that I can't be replicated. Duplicated, imitated, fabricated, eliminated, but you can never replicate me. I'm my own person. I'm me, and you ain't never going to get another one like me. So, hell yeah. Everybody just a little bit here, so it'll miss it. I can't be replicated! If they killed the rappers who were spitting truth, they wouldn't have a messenger to reach the youth. So they duplicate physically, implant abilities, replicate tattoos and cloning facilities. Indie contracts say worldwide. Label contracts say universal. For all of time and all forms, they own all your music, your image, your name, and your person. <laughs> Weird, right? I know you don't think that is facts, but for 50,000 and a hair sample, you can clone your dog or your dying cat. It's another way for them to win the war by weaponizing important celebrities. Don't kill your foes, just clone their gods Then you'll control all your enemies The executions have been televised though. Listen to that like, I took a second for that to kind of sink in there. Listen to that. Dog or your dying cat. It's another way for them to win the war by weaponizing important celebrities. Don't kill your foes, just clone their gods. Then you'll control all your enemies. Don't kill your foes, just clone their gods. Then you control your enemies. Like, if you take over and basically just, like, you clone their god, you clone their belief system and everything. Like, you take over their ideals and then you kind of become the head of it and you twist it in a way that they start following it whether they realize it's you doing it or not now all of a sudden you're in control just like like he's talking about this whole song here the, the, the all these rappers the mainstream rappers mostly um not all of them there's a lot of them though that are all the same they look the same they sound the same they act the same a lot of their songs are about the same shit. Like, dude. They do that to control the masses. Don't kill your phone, just clone their gods. In a lot of society, musicians are not necessarily the gods to people and stuff, but they're really highly looked upon and everything. You know, I, I personally use music a lot to help me through a lot of shit. You know, so I mean, yeah. Yeah. And all of a sudden, like, basically the masses are the enemies to the ones in power. So don't kill your foes. Don't kill the masses. Just take over the ones they look up to. Clone them. Make them do what you want to do. And then you control everybody. That's basically the big message of this song is from what I'm getting. Like, this entire song is just about that. So you're probably going to hear me repeat that a lot. Just saying. <laughs> Let's keep going, man. This song is pretty awesome so far. It's not his typical style. It's really not, it's not as in your face and like heavy, you know, and him just kind of spitting and going off. It's pretty, it's like laid back and everything. You hear, it's very well articulated. You hear like every word, you hear every line. And I really like that. It's really cool. The war by weaponizing important celebrities. Don't kill your foes, just clone their gods. Then you'll control all your enemies. The executions have been televised, though. They're on TMZ like a night. 
They take our heroes, give us weaponized clones. The revolution won't be televised. I can't be replicated. Copy the attitude and it changed, but no one will ever do me the same. I can't be replicated. Try to control me, then guess again. Rebellion lives in my DNA. I can't be replicated. Duplicated. Okay, he did say that the lyrics right here on this website got it wrong. So yeah, he did say I'm the glitch in their matrix, they can't escape. He's the anomaly. Okay, so I did catch that right. Okay, this website needs to be updated then. Shit. All the other lyrics are so far are pretty are right on. You know, kind of reading along somewhat with it and everything. But yeah. So that bar is fucking phenomenal right there. I love it even more now. I mean, it was good still to get into the Matrix they can't escape. But no, I'm the glitch in there, Matrix. He's the anomaly. He's the one that's tearing the system down. All right. I can't be replicated. You can see the difference in their face now. Casualties of money and the fame. Posing for the cameras with their fake smile. A clone of someone who they used to be. I can't be replicated. Copy the attitude and it changed, but no one will ever do me the same. I can't be replicated. Try to control me, then guess again. Rebellion lives in my DNA. I can't be replicated. Duplicated, imitated, fabricated, eliminated. No, I can't be replicated. The system designed me to be a slave. I'm the glitch in the matrix that can't escape. I can't be replicated. Video by Nova Rockefeller. Shout out to Nova, man. Her video videography skills are phenomenal, man. Her camera work, her just editing of the videos, man. Great job yet again, Nova, on the video. Tom, fucking phenomenal job again on the lyrics, dude. Like, basically, like I said, man, this entire song was just one big... Like, just telling how the system really is. Everything is a plan. It's all a design to, to make everybody think a certain way, to act a certain way, to push towards this product, that product, whatever. And, crap. and it works on a lot of people, you know. It sometimes works on me. It sometimes works on you. It works on everybody at some point in time. Hey, the biggest thing, though, is eventually waking up to that fact and decided for yourself to not follow that crap anymore, you know. And half the time, it's really, really hard to discern what's that crap and what's really you. That's just the reality of it, man. But phenomenal song, dude. Great job yet again, Tom. All right, that's it. No bloopers or nothing? Okay. <laughs> it wasn't really that kind of video to have bloopers at the end. So... Pretty much said all I needed to, wanted to, during that one. I loved it, as always. It's Tom McDonald. Like, I haven't heard a Tom McDonald song I didn't like, even off of his old music that he himself has said he doesn't really like anymore. He doesn't like his old music. I still fuck with it. I still like it. It's really cool. You know, there's a, there's a few songs down there that, it's, that I'll listen to. I still like them. But there's other ones that I listen to way more, of course. You know, there's things like that with every artist. So... <clears throat> Let me know what you guys thought about that down in the comment section below. What you guys thought about this, my reaction and the song. Uh, be sure to hit that thumbs up button for me. Share it on any kind of socials you have to your mom, your dad, your sister, your brother, your aunt, uncle, cat, dog, your goldfish. I don't care. Let's get it out there. Let's bring more members of the Wolfpack in. If you aren't a member yet, hit that subscribe button. Click the notification bell. Become part of the Wolfpack. Get notified every single time I bring another badass banger like this one to you on your computer screen. So, with all that being said, guys, I will catch you on the next one. Y'all stay frosty. Peace out, man.